So first of all we will understand what is electric power. So electric power is denoted by P. This is the usual notation that we use. So this is called energy dissipation. Energy dissipation in a in an unit time. So that means power is given by joule divided by second we call it joule per second and 1 joule per second is equal to 1 watt so 1 joule per second is equal to 1 watt so power the units of power would be joule per second or watt and then how do you define it power is equal to energy E divided by time. So energy within a resistor would be the voltage. So V divided by time. Okay. So now um, electric power is energy divided by time. So now what is energy? So this is electric energy. So energy is given by uh, Q times V. Q is the charge. Q is the charge. V is the voltage. V is the voltage. So this concept I will teach you in a different uh, lesson. And divide by T. So E is equal to QV. So we have a, a you know concept in um, electric fields which is WV is equal to QV. WV is nothing but E. So I put that QV over here and then that would be qv divided by t now what i will do q divided by t i consider times voltage is p now what is q divided by t is rate of change of charge rate of change of charge rate of change of charge is nothing but current i so this is going to be i times v or v times i so the definition of current would be rate of change of charge how charge is changing with time and that would be current so now p is equal to vi is what we use now we know so power is defined as voltage time times current vi now we try to you know find some other ways to write this power so v is equal to ir we know that so we can replace v by ir so then power can be written as i squared r so that is another way of writing it there is another way of writing on, on top of these two what if i subject i that would be v divided by r that I will plug into I. So that would be now R, uh, that would be P is equal to V, I is replaced by V divided by R. So it's going to be V squared divided by R. So now we have to understand there are three equations which we can define the power. This is electric power. P is equal to VI or i squared r so let me let me write this in terms of uh, simple i so that i can maintain the consistency so i squared r and the other one would be v squared divided by r so there are three equations for power so now we know power is the energy dissipation power is energy energy lost or dissipation per unit time unit time so that means p is equal to e divided by t so that we know what is e here e is the total energy total energy total energy in t time so to find energy in one time you know in unit time so we divide that by 
T. So now if you need to find the total energy, so you obviously have to uh, cross multiply. So that would be PT. So now P would be VI and you multiply that by T or I squared R T or you can say V squared divided by RT. So you can use these three equations to find the total energy. So the difference between the total energy and the uh, power would be total energy is measured for T time of period. Power is energy which is measured uh, for a unit time. So that's the only difference. So that, that tells you basically when you are calculating power T becomes 1. So that's the essential thing that we have to understand. Okay, here the total energy dissipation for uh, in an hour. So that means one hour energy is dissipated. How much? 10 to the power 3 joules uh, in a resistor. Right? So in a resistor, this is happening. How much is that? Yeah, 10 ohms. R is 10 ohms. So that means within one hour. So T is equal to one hour now. So one hour means 3600 seconds. So within 3600 seconds, how much energy is dissipated 10 joules sorry 10 to the power 3 joules so now we need to find the power so power means what power means energy per unit time so this time in this question we have to take energy per second so energy per second energy per second means energy in one second energy in one second so you know within one hour or 3600 seconds um, energy dissipation is 10 to the power 3 joules so how much energy is dissipated within one second so that would be 10 to the power 3 joules divide by um, 3600 seconds Okay, so the power would be, power means energy, this is energy, this is energy in one second. This one is energy, energy in 3600 second. So power would be now 10 to the power 3 divided by 3600 joule per second or what? 